Hey guys, here I am at Summer Festival at Land Rover, and there is, they actually added a couple of quests right now, so I don't know how many parts this video will be. It may be a couple of parts, but this is the new, uh, I don't know if she's a new NPC, her name is Tensa Tightfield. I am here with uh, my nephew's character right there. Um, that's sitting. That's sitting, that just sat um, right there. But this is the quest, I'm going to talk to her. We're going to first do the first quest called Cooling Off. Could I take a minute? So the first time? quest is Cooling Off, and basically there's three quests, but I'm going to do a quest called Cooling Off. The jug of water will be right here next to her. Water jug. And I'm going to pick that up. And now, I can actually ride a horse doing this. But now I have to find overheated patrons. They're obviously just going to be, it's a very easy quest. And some are gonna be just right here, overheated. So you go near them, and then yeah. you would just press the button. And that's the emote you do. I think it's funny, but let me show you again. There we go. That's the. That's what you do to the overheated patrons. The thing is, what that emote basically is one of the emotes you can get in this festival. So now I'm going more, looking more for overheated patrons, which are right here. It's very easy because obviously, look, you just have to get off your horse and press this again. So you do that basically all five times. So that's the first quest. What sucks about the um, this emote is it's bind on a choir. So. I actually have to freaking do my festival, uh, festival repeatables, which is not. Okay, now I'm going to my last one, and this is on my minstrel candy boo, and I am here on Land Rover. And if I haven't done any videos recently or much videos, it's because my nephew is here for the summer, so I haven't even done the new raid at all yet. So where is it? Supposed to be right around here. Ah. And this is my last one. There we go. We're gonna turn that in. Where is he? It's a bit difficult because there are lots of people here. Oh, here's gonna turn in right here. So that's one of the first few quests. Now I'm doing this one at a time, you can do this more than one at a time if you want. So now I'm gonna go talk to her. Defeat the heat. Oh, that one's kind of annoying, but basically... Stay and have some tea. You're gonna see fire grims around like this. And basically you have to right click it. If someone obviously already took it, there's no point. Because if someone already took the fire, then you can't kill it. Um, my nephew is located one, so I'm going to right click this, continue, and then you attack. Basically, they are all in different locations, so just because you see one, they're basically not going to be the same one. There are five different ones you have to do, five different locations, so you can't be just doing the same exact one all the time. There's a second one my nephew found. There we go. So now we're just going to look for the third, last three and that quest is done. This is going to be my last one. Except it moves a lot. Oh my god, there we go. Okay, that quest is complete and I'm turning that in. Okay, so now we're going to do this quest that my nephew is talking about. Which he's done this. I've done this actually on my other alts. So it's called Ice Delivery, and I'm not going to read that because I already have done this, and if you want to read it, go ahead, but I'm not one of those people that read everything, so blah blah blah. I just know that there's Ice Block here, and we're going to pick it up. These Ice Blocks look really cool, I think, and then we're going to pick it up. And now we're going to look for where we need to go. I think we need to go to, yeah, we need to go to buy water, but while you're going to buy water, you actually... Well, I don't know if you've heard my nephew, but basically, you have to watch out for... You know, there's those quests in the Shire called Noisy Hob Nosy Hobbits or um, Hungry Hobbits. Now, this, they won't have those icons at all. 
they're just gonna have a fire icon over their head. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna try not to stay on the main road because usually they're on the main road. They're on the main road. Okay, now my nephew sees someone that has it. Elderly Hobbit. Yep. It's apparently why does it have to be elderly? So you cannot, it should, you should not even be close to that elderly hobbit. You just start, go, try to go around them. Yeah, if you go near it, you're free until the elderly hobbit goes away. And if he doesn't, then you're gonna have to, you're gonna lose your ice block. And then, then you're gonna have to teleport somewhere. Because if she stays there for a long time, you're gonna have to teleport there to camp, maybe? So basically, my nephew was saying, well, here's, let me turn this in and I'll explain exactly what my nephew was talking about. We're gonna talk to her. Finish this now. Good day. That's actually finished. The three quests that was over at the party tree are done, but she gives you another quest here to get hey, ice cream. Some tea. The ice cream will be right here, and we, I think we're gonna go turn this in at the bar, or the bird and the bee. So we're gonna do this. And then collect <laughs> fresh fruits from the market, which is right here. And my nephew apparently didn't do this quest yet. Nope. Well, now you've done. Then we go inside this tavern, the Green and the Dragon. Oh yeah, there. Because I thought the ice suit. And now we're gonna talk to this person. Can't a body be left alone? Mix the dessert by clicking the icon right here. There's a kin member right there, but I, I'm doing the quest so I can't really emote her. Bring the frozen dessert back. So I'm going outside to turn the quest in, but I'm actually gonna thank this girl first. Slash think. There we go. Do a wave. And now I'm gonna turn in the quest. Bring the frozen dessert back. Oh wait, so I actually have to go back to the party tree. Thankfully, my nephew is with me, and my nephew is just gonna port us back to the party tree because oh, yeah. she's a hunter. Yeah. You mean he's a hunter? He's a hunter. Yeah. And the character I'm playing is a she. Yep. That's why I'm confused. So there we go. Now there's the port. Now we are porting. Obviously, if you don't have the port, you just would ride back here to the party tree and turn it back in. So now we're gonna turn in this quest. So those are the three quests on this specific NPC. Finished. A lovely day, now. isn't it? Okay, so that finishes off those three quests from this NPC at Summer Festival. This is the other new quest here at the party tree. We're gonna talk to her. Good and day. it's basically a quest a recovering kites that's crashed in the party tree location. We're gonna accept well, this. Kinda close. Yeah. I already did this first, so I already know where they all are. So that's my nephew talking. He doesn't know it all. So here's one. He doesn't know it all and his attitude problem because that's a family trait, apparently. Going up. There we go. One out of six. Okay, Gavin, show me. You're too far. Do you have your speed buff on? No. Well, I'm gonna go north. Okay, I'm just gonna actually follow my nephew. Okay, there's, there's one. one yep, I see one right way. here. So my nephew led me. And by the way, these yes. kites that we are picking up, those are the same ones that you can get here as a cosmetic pet. The one that costs mithril coins is actually prettier, but that's if you're rich. I mean, you know, yeah. I'm not personally getting it myself. So this is three out of six. No, there's not. So I'm gonna go north. I'm gonna go look on my map. I'm gonna go to the one that's on the map. I thought there was one near the campfire, but I don't know. So now we're gonna look for the fourth one. There it is, by the tree. If you're gonna see how the kite looks like, I'm pretty sure if some of you probably already saw them because this will probably be posted the day after the festival. But I do have Instagram, um, Ogalichi Wiz, and there is a picture of two 
of the kites that you are able to get here I personally do not like the color dyes from this festival because they look plain so I'm not even gonna bother but I am trying to get the um, emote so now I'm trying to get my last kite which is supposed to be around around here by the apple trees and there we go this is the last kite we're gonna turn this in I have no I don't know and there we go we're gonna finish that here is the other quest um, it's all about flying kites so basically it's this NPC named Hargold Hard Bottle and basically you have to find five kites and you have to fly them for a few seconds and I don't know if you guys can see but there's a bunch of people here in um, Land Rover because it's festival usually yeah and then look at this miniature um, elephant oh my god a hobbit owns that this little cute hobbit right here named Pivo he owns this um, little elephant. Is that cute? So, I'm just gonna go to the lo located points. And as you can see, these are the kites. And I think these kites are so much better looking than the one they have for that you can get. Like, what the heck? <laughs> Obviously, look, you can fly it too. The same animation. Okay, so that's one. My favorite one of them all of the kites that you have to fly is actually the one near the river. And I'll show you why. Um, once we get there, let me show you guys the kite first before I actually take it or read it. But that's how the kite and the design of the kite looks like. That's pretty awesome. So I'm just gonna get the last three, and there's the um, quest for flying kites. Yeah, but anyways, if you guys want to see how the kites look like, and if you haven't, this like I said on my Instagram on. Oh golly gee whiz on Instagram and it's a kite there. One of the kites, well they're there. Uh, so. uh, one of the kites are the same as the kites that he picked up. I already told him that one, Gavin. Oh. I'm trying to... Oh, don't, that's nothing to be sorry about. So what are we doing again? Oh, okay, Gavin, here, stand next to me so we'll do our bye bye or whatever. Uh, We're here. Uh, I'm jumping up and down. Okay, there we go. Stand still. Okay, so thanks guys for watching and leave a comment, share, and subscribe. Bye. What? I said bye. Oh, okay. Well, thanks guys. Take care. Oh yeah, make sure you check out my video details or links to my Instagram, to my Twitter, Facebook page, blah, 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 blah. So bye.